Woo! Early morning randomness. I almost forgot what video I was doing. <laughs> okay. I don't know. We're already starting off good, ain't we? Not speaking English and, uh, you know, not remembering stuff. I mean, it's become the norm. Yeah, you know, I mean, four years worth of these on and off. I mean, you're looking at probably in the last four years. It's probably safe to say I've done 500 of these over the last four years. Because when I first started doing these in 2014, I did 113 in a row before I, before I forgot to do one or just couldn't do one. Um, so, yeah, just deal with it, okay? Just deal with it. It's Monday. Usually I'm off Monday. Usually my days off are Sundays and Mondays. But this week they had to change it up a little bit and I have to work Monday through Friday. So my days off were yesterday and then I'm off Saturday. So I'm just working on Monday through Friday this week. Um, so, yeah. Just looking forward to it, you know. I mean, God, just it looks like it's gonna rain. I mean, yeah, hey, Mother Nature's getting it. She's getting it in. She looked after us though on our trip this weekend. It was supposed to rain all day long Saturday when we went to Chattanooga, but it didn't really start raining on us till the very end of the night. We were going back to my buddy's house, so that worked out. It worked out nice. All the shit I talk about Mother Nature, and she took care of us that day. She's going to get it on the back end, though. She's going to find a way to just piss uh, just all over our life. But, uh, hey, <laughs> if y'all haven't yet, be sure. Go on my page right now. I uploaded a new song uh, with my homeboy B. Howard called Lay Up. It's produced by Nice, and I love it. It's getting good reception. Um, looking forward to that. That's going to be on the, the Baker's Dozen project. So... Of the 13 tracks that's going on that album, I've leaked uh, Lay Up, I leaked Coolin', I leaked Bubble Wrap, and then of course, the one with Roach Baby, months and months ago, She Can Get It, and the one with Lee Lee. So I've leaked like half of it. So I think that'll be the last, I may leak one more uh, before I drop the album. I'm trying to, I'm planning on dropping it on Memorial Day, which will be a Monday, um, in May, I'm trying to, usually Memorial Day is towards the end of May, so that's the plan, so I've got like two more tracks to finish once those are finished, I'm going to put a cap on it, and then I'm just going to start recording for Volume 2, so we're just going to keep this train moving, I'm going to try to drop Volume 2 on uh, on uh, Labor Day which is in September so, try to just try to just drop something on the, on, the, on the dome piece you know, every three months, why not you know that's what you have to do now. Like people's uh, people's attention spans are, are are this fucking big. You hear me? Used to you could take years to work on an album, and people would just wait and wait and wait. Now it's like every three months, like where's 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 your new mixtape? Where's your new EP? Which is fine. It's finally working in my favor because I used to put out a lot of stuff like that back in the day. People were like, "Dude, you're putting out too much shit." Because I'd put out I'd put out a mixtape like every three months. People thought I was fucking insane. Now, I was a fucking head of my time, apparently, because now it's like if you don't do that, you fucking fell off. So, just the good thing about it is I do whatever the fuck I want, okay? That's the beauty about, you know, just being on, just doing your shit independently. You just do what you want when you want to do it. And, yeah, fucking get over it if you don't like it. I love you, though. Um, so, I haven't worked a Monday. I can't remember the last time I worked a Monday, so... It's hard to gauge how retarded people are on Mondays. I'm assuming they're just as just as special on Mondays as they are on Wednesdays and Fridays and every other fucking day. So, we, like we've like we've been saying for, for for weeks now, don't be fucking ignorant. I mean, just think to yourself: Am I being a a fuckhead? And if I am, because deep down in your hearts of hearts, you know that you are. Don't fucking stare at me. I know you're 96 years old. You shouldn't even have a driver's license, if you want my honest opinion about it. I'm not an ageist, but I'm realistic. If you're 96 years old and you have a driver's license, I'm getting the fuck away from you. <laughs> but uh, like we were saying, um, you know, just, just, just be nice, tink tink, okay, little tink tink. You coming in and getting your $25 gift card or, or credit back for your fucking. Keurig coffee K-Cups that you got the wrong ones of. 
hey, just, just calm down. It ain't the end of the world. You're not going to go to prison or anything if you don't get it returned. So just, just love each other, okay? Love each other. Very simple. Um... Don't be some don't be some DAMFs, okay? Don't. Don't be some DAMFs. Don't be some dumbass motherfuckers. I love y'all.